Just a really quick update for you guys. I tore these motors apart and it looks like that's the problem right there. Uh, when all three phases of the wiring touch, the motor no worky anymore. So it looks like they got really hot for whatever reason. I don't know why because th there really wasn't a strain on the scooter at all. I mean, I was going down a forest service road 13 miles an hour and uh, the motor just locked up. It looks like all the wires inside here are just cooked. Uh, the other motor looks the same. So, I'm not sure what causes that. There's supposed to be a uh, safety feature on these that turns the motors off when they get too warm or when they're getting to that point. But I think maybe this one was just defective from the factory. I'm just guessing. But uh, pretty simple basic design. Um, looks like it just might have been a factory defect. And then of course um, the, other, the other motor probably got really hot trying to get this one to move which is why that one failed too so yeah totally trashed inside anyhow I thought I'd give you guys an update for those of you that own these scooters this is what it looks like inside here um, the other one I tore apart completely but there's just a bunch of magnets on the inside and then here's the stator and it's trashed they're all melted together on this one too even though you can't see it it's on the very inside um, down inside the stator there so anyhow figured you guys that own these scooters might want a little update on what it looks like when they fail I guess but there it is for you alright guys if you like this episode give me a thumbs up if you're not subscribed yet, I'd love to have you as a subscriber. But as always, I hope you guys are staying safe, taking care of each other. And I'll catch you next time. See you later. Bye-bye.